Hello everyone. Today our session is to discuss new features introduced in Oracle Payables so release 12.2.4. There are major two features introduced. Let's go through those features. First one which we are going to review is parallel approvals in Oracle Payables. So release 12.2.4 has introduced new feature sending workflow approval notifications in parallel. This is a change in invoice approval workflow and this will allow invoice header level approval cycle to send notifications to all approvers simultaneously and it will enable to reduce overall approval cycle time. During my experience on different projects, we have seen that number of customers required this feature prior to release 12.2.4 and I believe this is a very good feature introduced in this version. It will enable different organizations to reduce the approval cycle time and improve the efficiency on the different approvals. Another change is done in invoice validation parallel processing. A uh, new profile option is introduced. The name of that profile option is AP Maximum Invoice Validation Child Requests. Added that controls the maximum number of child requests that can be spanned by the Kankan program. In the next slide, we'll see how you can set up this profile option through your responsibility of system administrator. You can go on that responsibility and simply search this profile option and you can set the value on that. Another feature is introduced that is International Bank Account Number Support IBAN. Customer and supplier bank accounts can be created or searched based on International Bank Account Number. This was one of another requirement because number of international banks have introduced IBAN is a unique number for any bank account and in Oracle EBS for any bank account, our requirement was to that we can search based on this unique number. And now this number IBAN is added in the search criteria so that we can search very easily based on IBAN number for any bank account for supplier or a customer. With this, we are done with the two fee major features introduced in release 12.2.4. And now it's time call for action. What call for action is please go back and log into your application release 12.2.4 and test these features, especially parallel approvals and then IPAM field. And must update me by posting your comments that you have done it, you have achieved it, and you are well, very well conversant with the new feature. Another thing is if you will face any issue, do let us know. We will be able to help you out. And if you don't have Oracle EBS 12.2.4 instance with you, I have already created very simple VirtualBox appliance step-by-step -step guide. You can go to otechtalks.tv and view this video. It will allow you to build your own instance release 12.2.4 within an hour. That's very easy step-by-step -step guide is available, but you have to spend some time to download the media from Oracle eDelivery. That's going to take time based on your internet bandwidth. Thank you very much for joining this session. I hope to see you for the next session.